Hey, it's Tony from Type 5 Reviews, and today we're going to be taking a look at how I keep ants, ladybugs, and spiders out from my house. Now, most of you have probably seen this ortho home defense stuff in one of your local hardware stores. You can get a gallon of this for about $20, and its main ingredient is a bug killer called Bifurin. All right. Now, while this product will work, from my experience, I've found that it doesn't last very long, all right? Things like rain, general weather, tend to make this wear off rather fast. And if I spray this, you know, it might make ants stay away for a, a week or two, and then I might start seeing them again, okay? So I've moved on from this product to one that I found that works a whole lot better. Uh, and that's called Suspend Polyzone. Now, an interesting side note about Suspend Polyzone is I had a door-to-door -door exterminator stop by my house one time asking me if he wanted me to spray for bugs. And I said, no, I, I do my own. I can take care of that. And he said, oh, what do you use? That ortho home defense stuff? And I said, no, suspend polyzone. And he just gave me a stare and was like, oh, really? That's the same stuff that we use. <laughs> so I figure if it's good enough for the professionals, it should be good enough for, for me to do. All right. So uh, you can find a bottle of this chemical on Amazon for about $51. Now, that might seem pricey, but it comes with 16 ounces and you only need either 0.75 or you can double that depending on your application per gallon of water. All right. So you can get anywhere from 20 to down to 11 gallons of water for your applications. So if you already have a pump sprayer or you need to pick one of these up for $10, all right, for $60 total, you can get up to 20 gallons compared to $20 for one gallon. So this will last you multiple seasons and you'll be able to spray your entire house. So we're gonna take a look at how we fill this up and I'll show you how I take care of the entire perimeter of my home. Since this is a professional insecticide, you'll wanna make sure that you wear proper PPE, including gloves while filling up the sprayer. If you get any on you, just make sure to thoroughly wash your skin afterwards. Don't forget to release any pressure from the sprayer before opening it. Once it's open, you can fill it about halfway with warm water before adding the suspend polyzone. To measure out the correct amount, only open the measuring side of the bottle, then squeeze it until the bottle fills the measuring cup up to the 0.75 ounce mark. You can then add it to the sprayer and finish filling it up to the 1 gallon mark. I use 0.75 ounces per gallon for general ants, spiders, and ladybugs, but you can find other application rates in the included instructions. Before you start spraying, keep yourself protected from overspray by wearing long sleeves, a hat, mask, and eye protection along with your gloves. To create a barrier of protection, I like to spray around every door and window as well as a few feet up and around the edge of my home. I've also used light pressure on the sprayer to spray inside around vents or in my basement. Just make sure that people or pets don't come in contact with the liquid until it's dry and safe to touch. While I continue spraying, if you found this video helpful, feel free to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more tips in the future. To finish, I also want to note that it takes about 2-3 to three gallons for me to cover the entire exterior of my home. And since Suspend Polyzone is formulated to last outside in bad weather, I found that one treatment in May and then a follow-up treatment in August is good enough to last me the whole year. And that's it! If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below, and remember, I've done the research so you don't have to.